Today we're going to be focusing on using warm and cool colors in our artwork. Warm and cool colors are two groups of colors that split our color wheel in half. Each color group reminds us of things that are warm temperatures or cool temperatures. First, we're going to be beginning with our warm colors. So find your warm colors, reds, oranges, and yellows for our first step. We'll be using those warm colors inside of our pumpkin. You want to shoot to use all three of our warm colors, yellow, orange, and red, to add dimension into your artwork. You can layer these colors, you can blend them together to create new ones. There are so many ways that you can add all three warm colors into your pumpkins. Remember to double check for white spaces. You want to be sure that all of your pumpkin is totally filled in. Now that we're finished the body of our pumpkin, we're going to begin using our cool colors. Our cool colors create the other half of our color wheel and they are our second group of colors that we're going to be using today. We'll be using our cool colors, greens, blues, and purples in the background of our artwork. You can choose any type of green, light green or dark green, to add color to your pumpkin vines and leaves. You can choose brown or green for your pumpkin stem. Feel free to use any color green to fill in your grass. If you added details into your grass, you want to make sure that those stand out even with our crayon coloring. So you could choose to use more than one shade of green or you can use heavy pressure on your details and light pressure to fill in the grass. Use any color brown to add in a color for your soil. And if you chose to add in some details, you can use any color you need to to fill in your detail work or your insects. You can 
choose yellow or white for your moon and stars, but it's important to fill them in. If you are following along with paint, you can move on to the next video. However, if you do not have paint at home, please use crayons that are the remaining cool colors, blue and violet or purple, for your spooky skies. You can use the crayons to fill in all the space around your pumpkin, the moon, and the stars.